ladies and gentlemen, Skeezy, Space Boy, and Slicky. What's up? What's up? Slicky. Hey. Slicky. Hey. Slicky. I think we're all just going by nicknames yeah, let's today, so what's why up, not? What, what's your nickname? Egg. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, my initials spell egg. Elijah Wait, Gus Griffith. Oh, egg. That's awesome. Yeah, that's my, awesome. my parents didn't put any thought into that, and I've got crap my entire life. Dude, for I don't want to hear it. Dude, people, my my whole family calls me BJ because of Billy oh J. <laughs> uh, oh man, you have it way worse than I, I do. do. <laughs> I'm yeah. so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> But hey, man, it's it's good to have you back up here again, dude. And, and it's uh, good to meet you, brother. Yeah, good to meet you. So uh, y'all are starting this new group called Trials of Terror. Yeah. Trials of Terror, yes. What made y'all go with this? We was on Facetime one night. And was like, yo, Todd. <laughs> <laughs> well, man, you've been making music for like two years, dude. I had an idea of it, didn't I? Yeah. Well, what, it was like it was like no, no. It was originally uh, what was it? It was like uh, T something T. Uh, v, wasn't it? Or like. I don't remember, dude. I don't know what it was. I know it that was like, Trials of Terror, the reason why we named it that is because, like, if you have a capital T, lowercase o, and another capital T, it looks like a face crying, and we're hmm. edgy like that. <laughs> <laughs> Edge Lord. What is the deal with, like, you know, like these pop punk. People with the whole sad thing. Why? Is, why are they all sad? I don't because know. I'm sad, dude. It's, thing, <laughs> it's a really sad, really sad time. Um, but the music is so good. World, yeah. Probably. I think it's it's more of like being relatable, like making yeah. music people can relate to, and that's what gives you streams. So like talking about sad stuff, singing about sad stuff, just makes everybody want to listen. It's relatable. Talk about problems. I get that. It's the same thing with like Kid Cudi. Whenever m- me and him were growing up, you know that's. Mm-hmm. Man, I mean, Kid Cudi, I've said this before on the podcast, he saved my life growing up, you know, and that's because, like, he was somebody I could yeah. relate to. So yeah. that's that's actually a really yeah. good point. So w- w- with the uh, style of music that y'all are making, like, are y'all going to try to keep it pop punk with some of the stuff um, we were listening to earlier? Actually, on the way here, we was talking about changing it to, like, a emo type hyper pop, like something that's not really been done before. Yeah, what, some kind of What's new hyper-pop? genre. It's like an emo hyper pop. What's... What would you like relate that to? Like, I mean, like, what's <laughs> like, what's an example of that? Like hopper uh, like Oliver Tree or something like that. Okay, maybe? okay, I like that. Dude. Or like one hundred Gex or something like that. Uh, all right, all Lil right. Uzi, Sofago, Kondra, yeah. Sofago's a big one. Who? Sofago. 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 I've never heard of Sofago. I've heard of him. Really? Mm-hmm. What's I know Oliver Tree though, Cash Machine. Oh, oh yeah, dude, stuff good, like that. Oh my God, it's such a good song. I, I love like how music just doesn't have a genre. No, dude. nowadays. It's, yeah, yeah it's that's true. You're mixing everything together now. I do everything, man. And and, and yeah. it's cool to have like this kind of like pop punk like renaissance yeah. coming up. I guess MGK started that. That's I don't know. Fall Out Boy. Like one yeah. or two. Well, well that, that's Panic's like the bad. bands like that like really started. I'm talking okay. about like the like the renaissance of it, like the last few years. Okay, okay yeah, yeah, MGK yeah, then. MGK probably, I would yeah. I would put MGK. Uh, Scar, right? Scar Lord. Or I would say Lil Peep, dude. That's oh good, yeah, Lil Peep was a big Lil one. Lil Peep started the whole. Yeah, yeah like, that's yeah. what. The you're popular right. roster. Peep, Tracy, all of GBC. Yeah. yeah. No, and that um that uh X X X ten. Yeah. How do you say that? It's Tentacion. 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 Dude, I don't even know. Uh, it actually means uh, unknown. Uh, unknown. Temptation. Unknown temptation. Yeah, that's what it means. Yeah, XXX Tentacion. <sighs> XXX Tentacles. <laughs> I was going to say something else, but <laughs> I, I was too. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. But I mean, it's 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 cool to have like this uh, new style of pop punk coming back, man. Because I mean, like. That was that was just good music growing it's my, up. Dude. It's refreshing, bro. It's like a breath of fresh air. Yeah. It's like yeah, it's it. nostalgic. Really oh, nostalgic. But it, it was also music that like you were talking about earlier that like kids and just people in general can relate to because a yeah. lot of just punk music in general whether it's pop or the grunge stuff or whatever, it was talking about real world problems yeah. and the stuff yeah. that people were having to deal with. It wasn't just, oh, I've got a f- Nice car. I've got a lot of money. Yeah. Can you imagine yeah. doing drugs? <laughs> 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 Pop punk being lyrics. like that. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it'd be kind of funny if they I did. Got it'd be, nice it'd be hilarious. <laughs> but I, it's 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 just so cool to like. It's like Joe Kenji. 
That's what he does. He's like the pop punk kind of like brag about everything he has, but it's pop punk. Hmm. I, I've never got people like that. That's the type of people I don't want to hang out with in life. <laughs> like, who cares, That's man? It. Yeah. I, I think music is just like it's supposed... Music is... If it don't have a purpose, then what are you making music for? Exactly. You know? That's true. I mean, like, music is art. It is. You know, and like that's like the people that we grew up listening to. Like they had an impact on our life one way or oh, another. Absolutely. You know, and that's that's the beauty of music. And it's also, I think that artists that do that stay more relative than those who don't. Oh, yeah, dude. People like that fall off so quickly, dude. Yeah. It's, it's the ones that jump on the bandwagon of trends. No, yeah, dude, I and, hate that. Yeah, see, mm. see, like, y'all, I mean, you really have your own sound, especially, like, what you do with your Space Boy stuff. Yeah. That's, yeah. I mean, the it's song unique. that you played me earlier, I've never heard anything like that. Mm-hmm. That's That was more of, like, a, yeah, a pop song. I wouldn't call it hyper-pop. It was more, it was slow. So it was more of just, like, a poppy vibe to it. Like, uh, let me think of an artist like that. Uh, Kid Cudi. I mean, like. <laughs> I don't know. So well, even him. Well, I mean, even really. then, it was like rap with Kid Cudi either. Like, he's yeah. always been like that little melodic rapper. That one was more singing, so I would I would relate it more of like just pop in general. Just yeah, right. dude, I don't I don't consider myself a rapper. Like, I used to rap a lot, dude. Yeah, it's still amazing at it. By the I way, I mean, I can rap. I just I don't know. I don't want to. It gets what? repetitive, don't it? I just don't want to be in that circle. What you made know? you want to like stop rapping though? Like, what's like what is it with the circle that you didn't like? <laughs> I don't know, dude. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's just I don't know man like I just I just never was I was always the emo kid you know I get that like the rock star type of kid with the long hair and like everybody yeah. that raps is like I don't want to hear that yeah, you know, why's your nose painted black you know Yeah. and it was like I don't know it it just rock and like pop punk emo it even fits you like more. pop it when I first met more. Skeezy I thought he was like 42 oh yeah <laughs> dude <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. He doesn't look 18. <laughs> I'm not 18. Are you 19? Yeah, I'm not 10, dude. You're for well, real? I'm only not 19? 10. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. He looks 42. I oh, thought man, he was. I, I like really Aaron. did. It's it's probably the beard. Oh, dude, when yeah, I shaved my beard off, I look like a 12 year old girl. <laughs> How long have you been growing that beard for? <laughs> I started growing a beard when I was like 15. You just haven't shaved it since? No, I've shaved it like twice since. So, like, I just I keep it. Usually. That's impressive. It's very impressive. That's very beard. impressive. <laughs> it's a beautiful beard. Appreciate it, bro. <laughs> but, I mean, I think that people... See, like, I started out as a rapper, too. I was rapping and making beats whenever I, like, first got into doing yeah. music. Right. And I think, like, you have to start somewhere, you know, mm-hmm. to, like, Absolutely, kind of find yeah. out Yeah, no one starts out amazing. That, like, rap wasn't even what I first started, though. Like, like I said on the last podcast uh, with Ghost Paul, I've been playing drums since I was, like, a kid. My yeah. whole family plays music. My, I, I played music with my dad. Like growing up, that's cool. You know what I play with my dad? Hide and seek. He's still hiding. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Can I go? I don't mean to laugh, man, but that was that, awesome. that was pretty good. That's that good. was pretty good. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> but like, <clears throat> the music's pretty much all I really know, man. So like, if anything from like rock, dude, I even did country before, dude. <laughs> oh, I have a song with you in the country. Yeah, dude, for I, real? I do everything, <laughs> man. I just kind of do whatever. What kind of country? I, mean, I never did like country, country, like folk. I mean, I do folky stuff. Okay, that was what the don't don't mosh by don't the mosh, pizza. Yeah, oven. I have an EP out. It came out in like twenty nineteen. It was all folk called music. Don't mosh into the pizza warmer. Pizza warmer. That's what I said. Uh, pizza oven. The whole thing is just like me and the acoustic guitar. Each song is like two minutes. That's cool though, man. It's just like singer songwriter stuff. That's what I would consider myself like a singer songwriter. But have they ever right. heard Go Yoga? It's cool for like artists to get out of their comfort zones, though. I think that it's really important. Uh, you, yeah. Sticking with one style, I mean it. <clears throat> it just even Jay Z done you that thing with Lincoln Park back in the day. Right. I mean, you, you have to switch it up every once in a while to really. I mean, MGK. I like his pop punk stuff more than his rap stuff. I do too. I do yeah. too. Did you hear a little Uzi? Uh, mm-hmm. On that country song. Yes, with uh, <laughs> Lil Tracy. Yeah, Lil Uzi. No. Yeah. Yeah. Tracy. Mm-mm. Uh, it was with uh, what? it's Kid G, I think. Oh no! It's his most I recent one that up, came man. out. It's 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 really good. Have you? I don't like, like I don't like the country part, but Lil Uzi killed it. What is Lil it? Uzi, Uzi huh? and Tracy did a country song a couple years ago. Yeah, called uh, like a farmer. Like a farmer. Yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Listen to it after this. It's it's uh, it's something else. 
Little Nas X, man, he started all that stuff. Uh, no, way, way, really? way before Little Nas X, yeah. Oh, ah, so yeah. Little Nas X ripped them off. What do you think Ooh. of Little Nas X? That's what I always said. Yeah, what do you think of Little Nas X? That's a good right. question. What's about? that one song I that think he he's has? All about Montero. Yeah, it's definitely clickbait stuff. But yeah, I think but, he's a genius, bro. Yeah. He's, 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 he's a genius. He's, yeah, he's, a mar- he's a marketing genius. He knows what he's doing, man. Exactly. What's that one song that he has? Montero. Though? Montero. That's a good. That's song. a good song. It's a good it's song. song. It's a good song. It is a good song. Yeah. And even video, people was like, "Oh no, it's a terrible video." Okay, I think the video is is smart because people's it's going to draw people's attention whether they hate it or like it. It's still. Them looking at it. So he still gets that extra that. view. Yeah, he still gets the extra yeah. view, whether they hate on it or not. He gets the extra view. He gets the extra dollar. He he always does it. I Crazy, thought, dude. I thought that he was going to fall off whenever he made Old Town Road. He I almost did. did. He made so many remixes of it, man. It's yeah. Like, yeah. Like like young thug, young five. thug, and no, that little man, kid that yodels. Like Twelve, fifteen of them. I swear he did. Yeah, it, it was quite a bit. And yeah. I thought that he was going to be a one-hit wonder. I really did. <laughs> yeah. My favorite one is whenever too. he had Young Thug and that little kid that yodels. Yeah. I forgot his name. Mason Ramsey. No sense at all. Him. <laughs> that one was funny. I like that's that one. That's so about random. That. That's so good. About that. Billy Ray Cyrus, Young Thug, and Mason <laughs> Ramsey. Well, he had we, he had other remixes too with other people, didn't oh, he? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. There's. I mean, God, we can look it up. I'll look it up. <laughs> yeah, please look it up. I really I want to know how many. But I mean, it, it's 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 getting. It's almost. Like we're in a simulation. It, life doesn't <laughs> yeah. seem real at this point. Yeah. Like, I, be, like, dude. Well, I was li- like, I was uh, listening to uh, Spotify the other day, and uh, they were like, "Oh, check out this new podcast with Bruce Springsteen and, Obama, and Barack dude. Obama." Hey. I'm like, "What? Hey. <laughs> what? Did it, I just hear that?" Right? Wait, is, is that the, a real thing? Yes. Old Town Road has been number one on the charts for. And well, it, and wait, it, why does I say thirty years straight? That's no, no. it's probably like it's probably like thirty on, weeks straight. But it, I think so. Like, I think it broke but the it world record. It has been remixed one hundred ninety-three times. That's that's not just him though. It's like oh, it's people like remixing people remixing it, the beat and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to yeah. find the official. All right, but still, so. I mean, Bruce Springsteen and Barack Obama have a podcast together. That that's is proof so, that we are living in a simulation. That, yeah, we might be, dude. You know, who, who knows, knows, dude. What do y'all think? Let's get weird. What do yeah, y'all let's th- get weird, bro. That's why I'm here, man. What, what do y'all I think, think of that simulation theory? I, I think uh, that uh, this isn't like real life. I feel like we're just like little characters in a game. That's I mean, what I think. Who controls the game? Like it, like, <laughs> well, <laughs> kind of, but we're actually talking not slew ba doo Like we're talking real. <laughs> what? <laughs> You've never played Sims? Yeah, my wife they talk plays, like that. They talk like that. It's like that. that's Dude, that's how they talk. Slaps, bro. You're supposed to Sims all the time. What, 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 what they about don't you? Say what do you think words. of the simulation theory? Dude, I mean, I don't know because I've never died before. You know, so it's like. <laughs> <laughs> no, but think how about do you know? It. You you're in a simulation. No, think about it. Let me die and I'll get back to you. <laughs> the simul- yeah, let me go check. I mean, you could have already respawned and you never know. That's what I'm saying. Dude, that's so uh, weird. Dude, I thought about this one time, dude. What if like when you die? Mm-hmm. You don't know, like it, you kind of. It's like you you just continue, like it continue existing, but it, it's like you're not really alive. Yeah, you're not alive. Like I'm dead, but still here. I'm still here, and I just I don't know. I Here's don't. what I think. I, I, I always had this. Too, I've I've always had this theory. I think whenever like you die, you keep living on, but in that world, like you you change like different realities. In that reality, you died. You, you know, you have a funeral. Oh, yeah. In your reality, you're still alive. There's still people around you. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, that'd be creepy, dude. I might be dead right now. <laughs> you don't even know. I might be All of us could be. Right really, now. You never know, man. Well, how they say like mathematics is like the language of the universe. Yeah, it's basically the coding of the universe. Yeah, and people say that like that kind of points towards the simulation theory. How Whenever it comes to computer programs and yeah. s- anything like that in general, how it's all encoded, mm-hmm. life. Whenever you get down to the technicalities of yeah. everything, it's all really coded. Like if you it's put, it's all math and geometric geometric patterns. Yeah, exactly. Ins- essentially, I, I mean, like if you put the right DNA together, you can make anything. That's oh, so yeah. weird. Dude. And, and, and I want to make a chicken pig. This but, is a pig with wings. Apparently, That's a picking. A picking. <laughs> a picking. I don't know how true this is, but apparently in China they made like a human monkey hybrid. Mm. They were working on like that. It. I want to pet it. I don't like it. That's scary. <laughs> a, a human. I wonder what it looks hybrid? like. I bet it looks like skeezy. 
That's like playing God. But apparently, like they, I think they, like they, I think they killed it or something like that. <laughs> Thank God. Like, but, 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 but I mean, this is the internet. I mean, yeah, who yeah. knows, but, you know? Like, but they, they did do that one thing though about uh, they genetically modified this baby oh, to uh, yeah. be immune to HIV. Yep. Yeah, and other sexually transmitted like, diseases. Like, why literally? Th- this, Where was that? Korea, South Korea? I think it's China. China? Look it up, just Something to be like sure. That. Are we still talking about the monkey thing? No, but, no. Okay. But, but, but still another weird experiment that they've been doing over there. And uh, I think the the doctor was found dead or something like that. Like, there's a lot of weird stuff. But, I mean, like, it actually happened. And now they're just waiting for this thing to grow up. That's so weird. <laughs> they're and, waiting for this thing, so it's not a baby? Well, anymore, it, it, it's a baby, but it's genetically modified giant. to be... To withstand like sexual so, so, certain diseases, yeah. yeah. I don't want to talk out of my butt too much. It's, it's immune to it, basically. It yeah, was, it was actually a set of twins, and it was in China. <sighs> it was twins. Weird. It was and in 2018. Like, I heard they're like they're trying to make like babies out of like bone marrow. You heard of that? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, marrow, yeah actually, <laughs> ain't that a real thing? I can't. They actually, I think. <laughs> yeah, they know yeah how they're to called do bone it. marrow oh. babies. Yeah, bone marrow babies, bro. Yeah. Oh. What's the purpose behind that, though? Yeah. Uh, That's a good dude, question. Because, <laughs> like, like, why can't they just use the other stuff? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, the real baby maker <laughs> thing. Yeah. I don't know, dude. The government scientists, they're just weird, man. They uh, scare it's me, It's a no dude. PDA oh, rule. Absolutely. It's a no PDA rule. <laughs> Who knows, man? It's it's getting really weird whenever it comes to technology and just what they're trying to I do. I think we've already went too far. We went too far when we made the Hydron Collider. What's at, that? At CERN. Yeah. Oh, CERN, dude. Yeah. Oh, my God. What's that? He knows. It, it's basic, and I don't want to talk on him, but I'm not smart enough to explain this correctly. I'm just bad but at like, ain't, really ain't, ain't, ain't that the way that they're trying to make the, uh, the black hole? To, yeah, they're trying to open the, the black God hole. Oh, yeah, basically. no, because 2020 before. wasn't bad enough. <laughs> 2021 wasn't bad enough. Let's just open a that. black hole. Because, you know. But they, they really, I mean, they're trying some weird stuff now. They need to stop. <laughs> they're calling it the God molecule or something like that. Yeah. Something like that. I'm kind of excited about it, though. Like, to, in, in my opinion, <laughs> what, the world is... Yeah, I mean, it's going to come sooner or later you anyway. Yeah, yeah I've been pretty bored lately. Be cool. A nice apocalypse would really I need a nice up apocalypse all. in my life. <laughs> but, but, like, for real, like, I mean, but, but there's no way we can, like, stop it from happening. No, nah, we just so, got to sit back and watch. Exactly, so why not at least, Wait, like, why would be we entertained sit back and watch? by it? Can we do anything about it? No. Nope. Let's bro. just storm it like Area 51. I mean, the world's in. I'm just going to pull out a lawn chair and watch it happen. They're going to win, man. <laughs> they can do whatever it is they want to do. They're they can winning. open black calls, but can't they do? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's literally... But have they succeeded? Ah. Uh, what is going on with that? They did the test back in 2018, and nobody talked about it, so... Oh, because no one lived to tell me. <laughs> but um, but th- 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 there's also theories behind that, too. That's why, like, they're saying stuff is so weird they, nowadays. Some people say that's why the Mandela effect is a thing. Oh, because the parallel universe. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we, they split it up and the, they made the hydron collider thing work and it didn't open a portal or anything or whatever it was, but it made alternative realities a thing. And I'm not smart enough to understand it. You just watch it. a couple episodes of The Flash and you'll understand. Pretty much. Yeah, but I mean, like, and, but they have the science behind it. I'm just not smart enough to understand it and try to explain it. That's fair. I, I, I can't it. either. I There's no way. That horribly, like <laughs> half the words you all have said, I can't even pronounce. Let alone <laughs> know what it means. I don't even know what like hydron is. <laughs> I, I, I don't even know what. That I know is. what hydro is. You ever watch? You ever watch the Avengers? Yeah. Wait. Right what's hydro in that? Water. Water. I, I, uh, hydra. No, I'm talking like Hell Hydra or Hydra. Oh, Hydra. Hydra. Okay. Hell Hydra. Oh, okay. Yes. okay. 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 I thought like somebody had some water superpowers or something. Water. <laughs> it's, water it's, it's getting to be weird nowadays. I think that uh, the uh, what's the dang thing that Elon Musk is working on? Uh, the chip. Yeah, Neuralink. Neuralink. Yeah. I think that's going to like really accelerate what stuff right there. What does that right even there. do? So basic, I, I know enough about that to yeah. be... Because I've heard of it. I just don't know what What's he trying to do? Okay, so it's going to be a quarter size piece of basically computer software type of device. Yeah. And uh, basically it's going to be the same thing as like jump starting a car, but to other like parts of the brain. Oh. And, and it's actually going to be a really cool thing because uh, people that are paraplegics, like they can... 
hook a wire to the certain part of the brain mm-hmm. that enables that, walking, yeah. Yeah. and they'll be able to walk again. People mm-hmm. with Alzheimer's mm-hmm. will be able to remember. That's awesome. And it's going to be a really amazing thing. I thought you meant they're going to shoot us up with drugs and we're going to become superheroes. But, but I mean, <laughs> like, that kind butt. of opens the door to it. Yeah. I mean, like, to it, open 100% of the brain because we can only use what's the percentage of brain we use? Versus like, how much you can use. I think it's like it's so small. I forget it's like or something. yeah, it's really and small. then it's so weird to think about. Imagine but, like what could you do if you had one hundred percent of your brain on the exactly. brain? Exactly, exactly. There's only like a two percent difference between us and monkeys. You know, like yeah. DNA genetically. Do you believe you know? in like evolution? Nah, you don't, I don't either. You don't? Nah. No. Well, what do you think? I mean, I, I, I just think that monk. I, I just think that we're our own species. You know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but how yeah. did how did we get here? Aliens. Well, it depends on <laughs> it depends on what you believe in. True. Yeah, yeah true. It, it, I think it, we're just here. I feel like at that point religion comes into play. Well, so. it, no, I mean, like I said, it, anything you believe in, like yeah, true. religion, anything. Yeah, and I mean, like everybody has their own belief, but yeah. in at the end of the day, nobody. Knows. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Vo- what I don't I'm voice saying, like, what I believe in. Like you can because believe that's what a terrible you idea. Believe in. Yeah, no, just yeah. for anyone, like, it could be a terrible idea. It could be a good idea. But. You know. Who knows? But w- whenever it comes to this Neuralink thing, mm-hmm. I mean, really, like, if we can open up other parts of the brain, who knows what's going to be possible whenever it comes If I don't have telekinesis, like I don't it. want it. You mm-hmm. never. If I won't be well, able to pick up that napkin right well, there, I don't want it. Apparently, they have figured out something to where, like, you can kind of telecommunicate with people. You can, like, people. open doors of your mind and stuff like that. And yeah. unlock Wait, watch us. Well, sure like, it's like, don't call me it's easy. Mind. What am I thinking? Dude, probably something weird. <laughs> wow, but, but he's already got it. But if you have like, like apparently, if like you have Neuralink and somebody else has a Neuralink, you'll be able to communicate telepathically. Oh, I didn't know that. With that yeah, that's, person, that's that's, uh, that's yeah. weird. That's dude. Yeah, that, that and stuff, like that's like legit, like something that they are like working on, making superhumans. They need to stop oh, yeah. before they stumble on something they don't want. Hey, I'm excited about dude, it. Me too. I'm not. I love yeah. stuff like that. I think got bit a head off of a bat and got COVID. I don't want. This Ozzy's been doing that for years. Who knows how that actually happened? That's why he hasn't got COVID yet. It didn't mean to. <laughs> Ozzy's already had everything. He's. Exactly. <laughs> He's I don't know if you can bro. name something Ozzy doesn't have. A, a good a successful a, a, a successful marriage. <laughs> yeah, <basically>. a successful <laughs> marriage. Ozzy don't care. Ozzy's Ozzy. He's going to outlive all of us. Him and oh, Keith yeah. Richards. Ozzy. Oh, yeah. The day Ozzy dies, the day the Weird. world ends. But, uh, and and the, even then. But apparently the Neuralink thing is supposed to be like something to happen this year. Like they've oh, already shoot. put it in a monkey and a pig. And like it's worked. Hmm. Like basically like with the monkey, I think that like it um, was paralyzed in an arm. Yeah. And like they got the arm to work again. I was going to say, if, if monkeys can like start like talking telepathically, then it's going to be like another episode of The Flash where Gorilla Grodd. And, like, talk to no, everyone. dude, it's gonna be the war, point of it. Has anyone watched yeah, The Flash? Sure. Was, was, Is nah. it just me? <laughs> it's probably. Well, the, the Flash? I watched back in high school a little bit. I love The Flash. Like, first season. I'll never stop watching it. I'm not ashamed to say that. It's good. It's amazing. It was good. I watched it. I love superhero movies. There's, like, there's, there's so many nowadays. I can't keep up with it all. I know. I don't watch the, like, the new ones, like, Supergirl or whatever her name was. Super Car- what? Supergirl. Ant Man. Supergirl. Ant Man. Uh, Ant Man and Wasp. Really? Yeah, I, Who's Wasp? Supergirl. Wonder Wow. <laughs> I love Super Paul Wonder Rudd, Wonder. but I don't want to watch a superhero movie about an ant. <laughs> like, I just, I don't, yeah. I don't care. <laughs> I, I don't, don't, I don't think the name Supergirl really sounds that interesting. <laughs> I think it's called Supergirl, ain't it? Supergirl? I don't know. DC, it, like the Flash, it introduced the, the only superhero I care about is Deadpool, dude. That's dude, <laughs> Deadpool is sick. Apparently, I like Deadpool. hey, did you all hear about? Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't want to spoil it if you all haven't watched it. What is, what it? is it? Have you watched Mortal Kombat, uh-huh. the new movie? No. Oh, no, I, I can't watch tell it. you. I then I can't tell that. you. Wait, was Deadpool like have a part in it or something? No, not Deadpool. Okay, it's it, it's not really. I can't. You have to watch it. Those are in the story. I can't tell you. I won't. Uh, no, it's not not really. It's gonna be like it's gonna. It's not gonna be like spoiling anything for you. You'll realize when you watch it, like when it starts, you'll be like, "Huh, where's this guy at?" But mm-hmm. I'm not gonna say it. Hmm. 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 Is is it actually good though? I heard it oh, was it's really amazing. Good. Oh, it's so good. Yeah. I, I've heard like mixed reviews because like, see, I, I grew up like on the original like oh, Mortal yeah. Kombat movies. Raiden, bro. Yeah, and, and playing oh, the games man. and all that. And I just like 
Whenever it comes to like the remakes nowadays, I get so I mean, nervous to watch really anything because I don't want them to ruin my childhood. Right. It's like because that'll just scar that image of that. Yeah. Forever. So, but Not I get. Really, kind of. So it is good. Oh, it's amazing. I check it out. Speaking of some. movies, what's your all's favorite actor? Oh, actor. That's a good one. I already got mine. Mm. I already got mine. I don't know if I can choose that, man. Dude, that's so hard. It's according what kind of genre of movie I want to watch. All right, let's do. All right, let's Tyler do. Let's Perry, do a, exactly. Oh, Tyler Perry. He can play it all. That's, that's oh, true. I don't know. That's, I'm, just, that's, I'm, I'm playing. I don't know. I really don't know. Well, man. I mean, Medea was a good series, dude. It's one of the best. I mean, one of the best to ever do it. I don't. I really don't know though. I want to say Ryan Reynolds. I was getting ready to say. Mm. He's so mm. like any part you put him in, he's amazing at it. Actually, Green uh, Lantern, he was terrible. But that's okay because he's not supposed to be a serious actor. He's funny. Right. Fad dude. I'm I'm Jack, Black. Black. Man, I'm Jack, Jack Black. Jack Black. Jack Black is hilarious. Oh, Jack Black. Black. oh, 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 oh. Kevin Hart. He's I a mean, good actor. I don't care for Kevin Hart. I like Hart, his stand really? I don't like his I don't movies. think he's funny. I don't either, man. Dude. I think it's annoying mostly. <laughs> he he has his moments. He's one of those that like like I like, but he was sometimes funny he's just oh, dude. Yes. Have you guys you know who Bo Burnham is? Yeah. Yes. Oh, Bo Burnham. Good. Yeah. God, that movie yeah. is so good. If I had to say, maybe Matthew McConaughey. Yeah, that's pretty solid. Oh, I love what about that. Leonardo? Does no one really like him anymore? No. I, I like I Leonardo, he's but he, he's, he's good. But he's creepy. <laughs> that's true. He, he, oh, like, what about dude, uh, <laughs> He dates chicks that are like 30 years younger than him. And really? like n- now, like with all the stuff that happened last year with Epstein and Harvey and all them. <laughs> it doesn't you, make him look too good. No, you, no. you start looking at these dudes like, eh, hi, hi, well, what are you doing behind the scenes? You, you know, know yeah. dude, you never know, man. You never That's know. That's creepy. Dude, they, they got Drake from Drake and Josh. Man, what do y'all, think? What do y'all think about that? R. R. That, that one, room. yeah. yeah. They home. got Drake Not from really. Drake and Josh. <laughs> dude, <laughs> Megan. Who are in the house, too? What? Yeah, they got, yeah. yeah they got, yeah. yeah. Ball, dude. Dude. Same thing. Am I allowed to say oh. that? Yeah. Yeah. Am I allowed to say that one? What? People know, I you know. Pedophile. Yeah, uh. but crimes against children okay. yeah, yeah it's really messed up crimes against children dude i would have never thought out of all the people drake from drake and josh I yeah for like but the thing i don't get is like well then again you know like i think that these people that are raised in this type of stardom you know it's, it messes like them. It mess, yeah mindset, it really messes really them up i mean like i I can't name many like child actors that have like that got out okay right Who's the one chick, Ashley Tisdale? She's like the most normal yeah. one out of all of them. Miranda Cosgrove. Miranda Cosgrove is pretty normal. What are we talking about right now? Well, like ch- you child- lost me, guys. <laughs> childhood stars that have like grew up to be like kind of normal. You, there's not many Selena Gomez. No, we're so going. Really. What really? What do you mean? Well, she's I don't she's she grew up to be normal. Yeah, she's, 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 she pretty has normal. she's pretty normal now, ain't she? Yeah, she's pretty normal. Yeah. Yeah. You're right, yeah. Yeah. I'll, that, but there's just not many of them. Right. And and a lot of times like something like you'll hear about like like Corey in the house. Yeah. <laughs> you'll you'll hear ten yeah. years down the road that he'd done something very messed up. And I just think that you know, like you don't have a child. Look at Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. Perfect example. Yeah, that's sad, dude. Yeah, yeah but I mean, like, you're grew, you grow up in this industry without having a life, it without just having... just how they think. I'm pretty, you know, yeah, it, it messes them up. Speaking yeah. of uh, Michael Jackson, what do you think of Michael Jackson? Do you think he did that? I think Probably. he's a scapegoat. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I don't remember the case too well. Yeah. But, like, didn't they find, like... He was like dolls at his house. They found the dude had a Ferris wheel. Okay, <laughs> he was on the if real you had the money, wouldn't you get you a Ferris wheel or something? Huh? Wouldn't you get you a Ferris wheel if you had the money? They're actually not much. I looked into it before. I looked up uh, how much an inflatable bouncy castle was. They're not much either. Like Five hundred dollars on one. It's, it's, it's <laughs> pretty cheap. But you know, Michael. Let's I just mean, put a let's just put a uh, uh, amusement park in one of our front yards. There's people that do it. Me and, my, me and my wife like love amusement parks, and that's why I looked into it one night. So actually, like, if I won the lottery, that's what I would spend my money. On. I can see that. Huh? Do I, I thought you know? said it wasn't much. It, well, it's, it's, well, I mean, like, if you want to have like a huge amusement park, but if you just want to have like, like, what, what are the things called? A gravitron. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, oh it's, my it, gosh, that, 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 that thing on, that like, like, won't let you get up. It, it's only like thing. fifteen grand. I mean, yeah, that's it's really not bad. people spend more on vehicles I than that's true. I, I actually see, razor. yeah, <laughs> I've not rode one since I was eleven. I think I think eleven. We had a Martin County Fair, and the Gravitron was in like the main back corner. No one was going to it at all. 
I got on it. Well, we get off of it. Um, I started feeling sick, and I was like, you know, I'm fine. Let's do it again. We've done it again. I get out. I'm like, oh, I feel even more sick. I should probably leave. But before that, my stomach started growling a little bit. I was like, I'm hungry. We went and got a corn dog from this mm. little corn dog stand. I went behind the gravitron and all of it back oh. up. Yeah. That's the Essen County Fair Ooh, rides, Gravitrons man. Dude, are those terrible. Are cool memories, though. Speaking of like fairs and stuff, dude, I've only been to like hillbilly days like twice my whole life. Dude. Really? For real? I hate man. hillbilly days. Too many people, man. <laughs> <I'm scared laughs> <of that. laughs> it's, how are they going to do that with COVID? I know they canceled last one, didn't they? Yeah. Uh, hopefully, hopefully they do next year. They I, canceled, are they they cancel this one too? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah really? Two in a row. Them. And man, I mean, city lost a lot of money too. I mean, that is it's one of the it's biggest cool. things for this. Yeah, yeah it's area. it's just for people like me. <laughs> yeah, like if you're Ooh, not people. if you're not a public person, then yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, I I totally get that. He's like, like, yeah, I was actually gonna go there this year. Yeah, Dang it! See, see, like I can hang out there for a little while, but after a while, man, you're just like it's pretty expensive. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty expensive. That, is that pretty food, that run so your pocketbook, up real dude. Close. The funnel cakes. I'm dude. Well, the funnel cakes are good. Funnel cakes are good. I always get. Uh, the uh, what's that one place that has the chicken and the rice, the um, bourbon chicken? I forget that place. Oh man, that whatever that is, know. that's good. The that's Amish good. donuts. That's good. Any alligator, like if they have yeah, alligator, I'm buying. I want to try it next time around. It's like the, it's like the if sweetest chicken you'll ever eat in your life. Oh. It's so good. And uh, see, we don't. I don't usually go to Hill. It's it's really far out of my way. I live in Martin County. Dang. Oh, so what we have the closest thing we have to eat in any hillbilly days is is uh, it's called Harvest. Day or something like that. Apple Days or something. Apple Days, yeah. Apple, Apple days. days. Yeah. Yeah. I've always wanted to go to Apple Days. I've it's like, nothing. To, it's really, there's nothing. You just walk around Inez going, ooh, ah. <laughs> <laughs> it's really nothing special. They bring a little petting zoo. You get one llama and one pony. Nothing else. One llama and one pony. It'd be kind of cool to pet a llama. Llamas are pretty llama bad, bad, yeah. Yeah. Llamas are pretty cool. Llama, like when it starts going, you don't like it. No, you walk no, away real quick. <laughs> because that's when they don't like it. Do they like? Do they spit on you? I mean, they can. Have you been spit on by a llama? Spat no, on? I'm not really. Is that how you say? Spat. spat. On a spat. field trip, I was like seven. We went to the home place up there mm-hmm. in my pine school. Well, there was llamas there, and it spit on Bester <laughs> and Blake. But it was like a big loogie, like the size of my fist, man. Oh, wait, it spit on llamas you? Llamas are no, crazy. No, no, I dodged it. It hit Blake in the face. <laughs> llamas, llamas are crazy. They can hurt. Those, those little spitballs hurt. Uh, it's, they I, hit hard. They spit with force, man. Yeah, they, they really do. do. They really don't They like. really want to show you, bro. It looks <laughs> They're like disrespecting you. They're on Star Wars. Like, the laser comes out of it. <laughs> <laughs> what's your guys' favorite animal? Like, what's your most, like... You like if dude, I could I ha- if I could have a, if I could have an animal as a pet what would it be anything dude, I'll if I could the ferret dude if I could domesticate sure, it, dude, I, want I, want, I want a monkey that'd be kind of cool Which, I would what love kind a, of monkey though because uh, there's many uh, like a spider monkey or something? No, what? finger <laughs> monkey they have finger monkeys no I'm talking about I don't know it's like a chip it no chip it's hard to explain it's, off, dude. it's like Bruh. it's like a baby monkey I don't know what it is I don't know what. It's like, it, it's like white in the face, white belly, and then everything's brown. Oh, I call, like blackout eyes though, like totally oh, black oh, eyes. Is oh, a, a lemur, dude. Is that, is that what, what you're talking about? Is it a lemur? That's like a raccoon toe. No, oh. no, it's an actual. Tail? It's a monkey. It's a, boomer it's a monkey. Mm. A lemur is a, a monkey. Food. Food. You know what I'm talking about? That's <laughs> a boomer food. That's Can I show you a picture? Yeah, show me a picture. Oh my god, you brought back memories, bro. Hey, them, them things are so cute, man. Uh, if y'all want like a cool place to go and see a bunch of animals, there's a place called Kentucky Down Under. It's uh, on the, like the western part of Kentucky. It's like in the time change part of Kentucky, so you have to drive quite a ways. But man, you get to pet kangaroos. Oh, kangaroo. and... I want to fight a kangaroo. Have you oh, seen those big bulk kangaroos? You don't like... want to fight a kangaroo. Brother, I always wanted bro, to. Like, like I, I didn't know like how big and like actually jacked them oh, things dude, were dude, until dude, I seen impressive. it in person, dude. Like this kind of monkey. Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's so cute. What, hey, what, what kind weird. of movie was that type of monkey on? <gasps> the hangover. Oh, the oh, hangover. No, no, no. Right. The no, no, no. Not at the museum. Yeah, that's yes. it. Yeah, dude, that's, that's, a, a, that's a spider monkey, ain't it? it? I don't know if it's a spider monkey. It's like a little small know. monkey. It's just a monkey in a Spider Man costume. <laughs> it's a spider monkey. <laughs> spider monkey. Spider. Hey, there's actually like places where you can like legit like legally own monkeys. I think yeah, it actually uh, is. Oh, West a Virginia, monkey. you can own a monkey really? legally. Yeah, That's not cool. in Kentucky though. Only in West Virginia is the closest place. 
that you can actually own a monkey in. What do you? I'd be scared. Though. I wouldn't. No, no, I wouldn't. It's like a baby, dude. Well, no, yeah, it's, but, it's. But also, I mean, like, dude, they can get vicious. Yeah, yeah, not like, if they're a baby, absolutely. though. Now, if you get if you get an ape, you can bring a bring a gorilla in there. Oh, you're done for. You yeah. better just. But even like just like regular like, uh, like if that thing like grows up. Let a baby monkey try to fight me. Let it. But like, but when that thing grows up, you know, it can it can rip off a finger. And and yeah. the thing is, like, monkeys are so smart; they know like what parts of the body to go for. Oh, absolutely. So well, that that watched, you actually need. I've watched Dragon Ball Z enough to know I'll just grab the tail. You just gotta grab the tail. <laughs> Good luck. You bro. Gotta go super sign on them. <laughs> you guys ever watch Dragon Ball Z? Yeah. Oh yeah. The, <laughs> so you know, grabbing the tail is like yeah. kind of like Super Saiyans. No, but, but not it, Super Saiyans. Saiyans no. It's so like if you there's this uh, like really famous case a few years ago about this uh, one guy that had a pet monkey and it turned on him oh, and dude, it, like ripped his face off yeah yeah bro. yeah I could do ripped yeah, his nose like, off yeah there's like audio of it yeah a video of it uh, man it's not a video it's like audio where it is so they called hard to listen one, to you can hear the monkey like screaming and like it is so hard to listen to. It is crazy. Dude, those nine one one like but but the thing but the thing is chill. though like like he like he still loves the monkey. You know, like, yeah. like Wait, is he still alive? Yeah, yeah. But yeah, like, I mean, is he ugly? Yeah. I mean, he, dude, he's missing his nose. He, uh, I think, ripped off some ear, like his ears. Oh or my god! A few fingers. And but that's the thing. Like, they they know what parts of the body to go for. Yeah. That would hurt. That so you bad. actually need. Like, they rip off, you know, genitals. Oh, yeah, they yeah. rip off fingers, the yeah. nose, eyes, ears. ears. They they don't go for like just any random part of the body. No, they go targeted. for the stuff you need. Yeah. That's vicious. They know how to make you bleed <laughs> out. Monkeys are up the devil, bro. Yeah. Yeah, man. I don't know about that. So, so I, that's why I, like, I don't trust them. I'll go. I'll go to a zoo and check one out. <laughs> sure. I, it. I don't know, like what type of like. As long as there's plexiglass. Do you all think? Us. Do you all think Harambe should have died? No, not I mean, really. I think Why can't they try? Don't. Did they try to tranquilize Harambe? No, I, Harambe? I don't. I. Mm, they did after they got in the cage. After well, they I, got I, in the cage, they they. I think they try. They were going to tranquilize them, but they were scared that like it would have like went crazy and started yeah. killing the. Yeah. But I mean, yeah. if you really watch the video and like really study it. Harambe wasn't really like trying to kill the kid. Right. Yeah. He was he, just trying to like, I, he thought it was a baby. So. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he was yeah. he was dragging it around it's just quite a, bad a bit. Situation, yeah. dude. I mean, yeah, but like they do that to their little babies, don't they? Yeah. So I mean, like he just thought it was a. I think the right. parents should have been watching the parents should have the, the parents should have uh, went to jail. The that's parents, the, key to it. the mom. Yep. Did what like, happened to the parents? Parenting. Uh, she actually she didn't get in trouble at all. I think she was I like. That's what I thought. I think I think she was like the parents. No. Nothing at all. For real, the kid's still alive though, right? Yeah. All right. I want. I want to hear his side of the story. <laughs> that, I really do. That'd be a good. That would be a good thing. Hearing his side of the story. I a bet it's too young to remember it. <laughs> Have they done a documentary about Harambe? No. Nope. Uh, they, should. they should. Netflix needs to pick that. Netflix, where are you at? That's what I'm saying. They need to pick that up. Dude, I watched this one documentary on Netflix. It was like, don't. Like f with cats, dude. Bro. I watched that. I watched that. Oh, dude. Oh, dude! I saw the videos. I like before I, I watched the documentary. Too. I had already seen those videos, dude. Yeah. God. What, Some wait, what is it about? Oh man, I don't even know where to start. I don't um, even think we can talk about that. Can I don't we? even know. I don't. It's almost too grotesque. It's pretty bad. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It, there was just like this one guy that like he was like a like a disgraced male model that put very very evil videos graphic on videos on the internet and it started out with a cat and yeah. i see and it. then it moved on to, to actual me. people and yep. i've seen that too. it's yeah. so messed up and i mean like i don't want to go into details but like have you actually seen the video yeah i've watched them i watched all of them and oh man it's and, just, how can someone i don't understand like your brain can't be wired normal right. for someone to be that like no but but the way that they got that guy was insane because like basically well it started out with the cat if, if, see that's where he messed up if he, if he would have started out with people nobody would have cared right but but he started out with a cat and us cat lovers we're going to get justice for this cat yeah. so, uh, <laughs> so 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 uh, basically like he got just is he people, still alive whatever happened they arrested him they arrested they? him I don't I don't they probably he's probably still alive. He's probably just still in jail or something so. like that. Fate is calling me. <clears throat> Put him on. What? What? Tell it. Is it vice time? Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah, I'll, yeah. Tell him, I'll tell him. You let him know. 
Ask Eli if you can leave it there for a day. Hey, hey, uh, we're live. So, uh, Hello? we're live. Hey, Gord. We're, we're hey! live. We're hey! live, so don't hey! say anything bad. Okay. Hey. What's up? What's that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> what is this podcast? Corey, where are you at? I'm at Walmart. How you doing, ma'am? How's Walmart? What's going on? I heard you're uh, shooting a new music video. Yeah. Yes, sir. Me and, me and Fangs are going down to shoot a video, and then I'm shooting a video. Don't, d- don't forget to mention I'm going with him. Zach said don't forget that to mention that he's going with you. Is he going with you? Yeah, he's going with me. Uh, going actually, with actually, uh, Fade wants to know uh, if I can just leave my car here overnight because we're coming back tomorrow morning. We'll talk about that. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Outcome doesn't really look so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can leave it at the church. Leave it at the church. Yeah. Jesus will protect it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, I, I like I like your new ink, man. You like it? Yeah, yeah. dude. It's nice. Iron and ash done it. Yeah, I got it done over there at uh, Family Dollar. They were, they were giving out free tattoos for a month. So. Hey, but hey, big shout to Iron and Ash, man. They're the ones that done my last ink, man. Katie and all of them are great people down there. Yeah, Katie and Clyde. Yeah, Clyde. Yeah. K- Katie done mine, so I couldn't remember Clyde's name. Shout out to Clyde, though. <laughs> Clyde is the tattoo yeah, guy. Man. Has they're, tattoos they're on his eyelids. Hey, what, what's uh, going on with that album you're working on? Yeah, that's a good question. Uh, <laughs> you, want me and, uh, you, want me and, you want me and Fangs to pull up the special guests? Huh? You, you want him and Fangs to pull up a special guest? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Are you talking about it right now? Yeah. Nah, dude, I have to leave it too. I'm sorry. I wish you could. You should let me know you're in town, man. We would have worked something out. I'll be back. I mean, I'll be back tomorrow if you want to. I'm leaving for Georgia tomorrow. The state that you just left from, actually. What part? Hawkinsville. Oh, okay. It's, it's like an hour for me. Hour and a half. Thing, man. Yeah, uh, let me know next time you're in town, man, and we'll do uh, the podcast part two. Okay. I love you, Corey. I love you too, man. Love you, Corey. I love you too. Let- <laughs> <laughs> Y'all do sound a little bit alike. Hey, wait, that's skeezy. <laughs> I love you, Corey. That's skeezy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bye. That would have been good. What were we talking about? <laughs> what, uh, we uh, something about uh, cats. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, don't f with cats. <laughs> yeah. So, so, oh. so <laughs> skeezy, slicky, same thing. Am I allowed to like leave and use the restroom? Yeah, go ahead, all man. Right, Are we know. keeping all of that in the podcast? Baby? <laughs> yeah, I Please? guess. I'm, I guess. Please. I'm... That's amazing. Oh. I just, I just want to save the part where, uh, where uh, he says, "See you, skis." <laughs> See you, skis. <laughs> but I mean, like Netflix, they. <sighs> They're, they're, they they do great on documentaries. They do. Oh yeah, they nail them, man. But they just need to. Where's the Eric C. Con documentary? Do you have Paramount Plus, dude? No, that's. So I love it, bro. I've been watching Beavis and Butthead every yes, night before I go all, to bed. Bro, all I'm watching is uh, Paramount Plus. There's <laughs> did, so many good shows on that. Did you watch the uh, new episodes of Beavis and Butthead that they done uh, like a few years when? ago? Oh, back in like uh, 2011 or whatever. Dang, is it that long yeah, ago? Dude. When they're they, making like, a new when, movie. when they're trying to like get Barack Obama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Was it that long ago? I, yeah, for real, has it been that long? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> They're coming Dang, back, dude. Though. They're I don't know if you movie. can, like nowadays. Probably not. They'll probably have to like tone it down a little bit. Probably. Yeah, like even like the new. I guess we'll say this, Jackass. The new Jackass movie that they're coming out oh, with. I, I, I wonder, like, how they're going to go about making that. They you probably know? don't I care, don't know, dude. They, they probably don't. They, I mean, they didn't back then, you know. Right. Apparently, like, Steve-O got bit by a shark or something the other day. Oh, my Did God. He? Yeah, that was like a... That's the most Steve-O thing I've ever heard. Literally. <laughs> yeah, he tried to, like... On you, Steve-O news. You, you remember that thing back in the day, uh, Fonzie, where he jumps the a bunch of sharks? It was like an old oh, 60s, yeah. 70s thing. But yeah. uh, they tried to, like, recreate that with <laughs> live jumped, sharks. Oh, my God. And, yeah, like, he got attacked by, like, legit sharks. What do you think of... Bam Margera, dude. Uh, 
Oh, it's That's so sad, man. Because he was like one of my favorites, dude. I love Bam. Absolutely. Bam, like, probably was my favorite out of yeah, all. Was, like, yeah. when, whenever I was a kid, like, I wanted to look like him and everything. Love Bam. I, I, I had the uh, yeah. I had the toboggan that had, like, the little bill oh, really? on it, you know? Dude. I had the element skateboards. I watched Bam. every episode of Evil of Bam. Like, Bam was Wild my Bam. dude. Bam's awesome. And, like, I think that. It was just Ryan Dunn, you know. I mean, like that's what. Yeah, it's been the same since Ryan. Hundred percent. That's exactly no. what it was. And that's why, like, his situation is so sad Do to me. Do you think they should have left him in the new Jackass? <sighs> it's that's a double-edged sword, man. It because, is. I mean, if you, if imagine how much money he would have made off of it, you know. And like, I mean, that's just like giving. Kind of feeding his addiction. Exactly. Basically, that, that's yeah. basically what they would have been doing. I, he would have made millions. It's really just a bad situation. Yeah, it, like I said, it's a double edged sword. It's I mean, you're, you're screwed no matter it's which way. Wait, where are we at right now? Talking about Bam Margera. What's up, man? Welcome back. Yeah, <laughs> so, hey, I was I was in there. I was on my phone. I was on Instagram, and I seen. Do you guys know what a megatherium is? A what? No. Okay, so they're saying ten thousand years ago. There was an elephant-sized sloth that was 20 feet and weighed up to four tons. A megatherium, an elephant-sized sloth. That's sloth. cool. That's awesome. Dude, that's cute. Bro. Imagine how slow them that. things move. Dude, it's just slow how small they are. Imagine how big it was. Like, Boom. Boom. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> they couldn't climb trees. I don't know what they did. They're bigger than trees. <laughs> I, I just man, but that Bam situation though, like it's, it's so sad. I know, bro. Wait, what happened to Bam? He, how he's like bad off on drugs oh, and everything yeah. right now, and, and he's, and he's not going to be in the new Jackass movie. I watched all Jackass <clears throat> movies; they're crazy. Well, we they're saw awesome. Jackass too much. I Even think it'll be uh, right. before before <laughs> no, uh, Ryan uh, Ryan Dunn died. Yeah, Ryan, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what what did they do? It was uh, did he die before the rocket thing they done? Yeah, well, no, it was afterwards. It was after that? He's been yeah. in every movie so far. Yeah. Except, except this one. Yeah. Was there I mean, another like, one? Who, who would have thought? Yeah, they're coming out with the fourth one. But it's, it's supposed to be Is the Steve last o one, in too. It? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, he, he, that's, where, that's yeah. what got us on this topic. Yeah, uh, he got bit by a shark. Yeah, he got attacked by a shark <laughs> during the filming of it. Yeah, that like, happened the actually, other day. Like, bit this yeah. one Steve-O knows. Yeah, yeah. Well, what does Steve-O like? St Steve-O always gets hurt, no matter what. Did you see where he put the fish hook in his... Yeah. Now, yeah, that's yeah, crazy, bro. dude. They, that's they, insane. They've done like a lot crazier stuff now. Like his the Wild Boys was like almost oh. crazier than Jackass. Oh, you guys ever watched the 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 Dutsons? The, uh, the yeah, the Dutsons. The Dutsons. Man. Yeah, I don't know what that is. It's like it's, oh, it was man. like the Swedish version of Jackass. Yeah, they they would, they they would do like some skits with Sweet. them every once in a yeah. while. Yeah, but like and dude, those guys got like really. Out there, really? yeah. Like, they like there's this one time they like climbed this ridiculously tall tree, yeah, and they just cut it down. <laughs> now, yeah. what was the? Uh, While well, I was in the tree, I, you guys I, ever watched Children of Poseidon? No. Mm. Oh my gosh, that? they done like stupid stuff. Like they had this a video called Cactus Boxing, and it was this guy I, don't, I forgot his name, but uh, their together was Children of Poseidon. And he was he took his boxing gloves. And he started beating the cactus up. Well, at the end, he's is like he's like cactus body slam. He jumps in the cactus, oh. in the cactus. Mm. It was so bad. There was one video where the blonde guy was eating a cactus, like oh. not not pulled the. It was all the prickles were still in the so cactus. Like the prickles were like in his mouth. Yeah, Dude. Like there was just, stuck, just there was even scenes where he was pulling out it out of his teeth. It was really bad. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> See, like I can understand like. Johnny Knoxville and the rest of that crew doing stuff Johnny like that Knoxville? because because they're, they're going to get paid for it good. Yeah. yeah. But people yeah. like that, you know, I mean, like, they made a living off of it. They were huge. I think now it's uh, what's his name? I know it. Um, but I mean, like, you really pay the price after that for a while. Like, even like Johnny. Oh yeah, one hundred percent. His uh, his well, dude, member, arthritis is crazy. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, his member, his member oh, do, man, doesn't like... work anymore. Oh yeah. What's oh, a oh, member? Johnson. The, the member. It's Johnson. Uh, Johnson and Johnson. Yeah. That don't work anymore. He like, he, uh, I, I forget I, how, I forget, I forget how he broke it, but yeah. Oh, I know he um he was on a go or a, a what, golf what? cart. Yeah. He was on a golf cart and he went up like a hill and the golf cart like went up in the air and like landed like right on Yeah. yeah. And yeah, yeah um, he has to. I think he like pees in a bag now. What? Yeah, well, like, Whoa, has, like, like, a, like, like a colostomy catheter. bag, just like worse though. 
Yeah. He has so. that bad. Yeah. No, it don't, it don't work anymore, bad. dude. Yeah. Dude, dude that's that's sad. Is, yeah. Does he have a wife? Pretty oh sure. yeah, I mean, I, oh, he, he's Johnny Knoxville. Dude, he's he's got money. He don't need that. <laughs> he's got Johnny money. Knoxville, you know he does. <laughs> he's funny. <laughs> exactly. He's yeah. a funny guy. He's a funny one. <laughs> but now, like, dude, he, even he has like gray hair and stuff. Yeah. He looks like bad grandpa, dude. Oh, like, uh, well, he, he is makeup. bad grandpa, ain't he? Yeah, but he don't need the makeup no more. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Did hey, you guys ever watch Bad Grandpa? Oh, I love it. That uh, was so funny. That was a because it was real. Like it was real. Like they they were like practiced for it, but. There was people there that didn't like the uh, like, like when they're in the restaurant and in the pageant. Go, goes Remember the pageant? Goes all the wall. Oh yeah. my god! Oh, the that pageant. was a funny one. Th- like throwing the money. Do you think that was skidded the pageant though? I it probably. looked a little sketchy. It looked like it was. I feel like the pageant yeah. had to been pre set up. Well, or yeah, because I mean, there was like, hey, parents doing this predator. to their kids. Like, yeah, yeah. Normal parents. Do you really think they would do that? Like, I mean, yeah, to cover their eyes, but it'd be like more like turn your head around. Turn your head not, around. Not like not like. <laughs> like those movie scenes and those big movies where they're like, dude. Yeah. yeah. There's just certain things that like. Pageants are weird in my opinion in, anyway. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. I don't see a point see, in them personally. That's just weird. Well, that's why brother. I didn't like that bad trip movie with uh, Eric Andre. <gasps> Eric Andre. Dude. But yeah. like, I, I, I love that. Eric Andre, but love man, I've like never that watched was. It. it was like, I watched a few of the sketches and yeah. like you could just tell that like it was set up. Oh, dude, yeah. I loved it though. Yeah. It, like, still it was funny. still funny. It was funny. But like. Yeah, yeah, that, that that was a good one. But like you, could, like just some of them, you could tell like they were just like it was all set yeah. up. And yeah. the, but you know, after a while, like that's why they started. That's why they had to do the it's bad grandpa big. stuff. Is yeah. because like people knew they who they were. Them. They're big. They're famous. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, when you're the face of jackass, you can't really just walk around normally. Sorry, yeah, Johnny. Exactly. <laughs> that's why they. <laughs> do you remember the uh, the uh, the 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 terrorist and the taxi? That they done oh, with the yeah, hair. Yeah, man. That was bad. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> they pushed the batteries. Do you remember when Steve O got on that crane with the, the big orca whale blow up? Yeah, thing? the sea yeah. whale thing. To save the whales or whatever. Yeah. Shout like, out to Steve O, man. Shout out to man. Shout out to Eric Andre, bro. Shout out to Eric Andre. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, His... nightmare. <laughs> His show, like, is so wild. It's, like a, it's like a. Fever dream, dude. Oh, absolutely, yeah. it is. But like n- now, he's too big. I, I don't even know like if he could do the Eric Andre show like he used to. He probably have to go out in a different like. Maybe a different. Well, country. I'm talking about like, like like getting guests on the show like he oh, used yeah. to. Like, everybody knows what's about to happen. Yeah. yeah, but back in the day, man, they did. They were not. terrifying. Oh like, yeah. Did you y'all ever see the uh, Ti episode? <laughs> yeah. Ti, like I mean, he about like literally fist fought Eric like, Andre. Was Rick noted when he was on the. <laughs> He was like, here comes the Hulk, and it's a skinny little Asian man, just painted green. If you, if you get near me, I'm going to mess you up. Don't, yeah. get your, don't get that makeup on me. I love that. Like, I, I, I still, I just love that they're coming back for a fourth movie. And God, I hope it's good. Well, Eric Andre's yeah. in Is he? He makes it, an appearance. And Post Malone makes an appearance. What? Though. For yeah. real? That's cool. Steve-O wanted Post Malone to tattoo... Something above his eyebrow. I think it was like a a member. Yeah. You could say above yeah. his eyebrow. He wants Post <laughs> oh my god! His post or uh, Steve-O has a podcast. Right. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've watched it. Oh, cool. Steve-O has a podcast. Yeah, it's good too. Pretty good. Yeah. It's really good. What's Very it called? Well done. What is it called? Steve-O's uh, Wild Ride, I think. Yeah. Something like Steve-O's that. Steve-O's Wild Ride. Yeah, Post Malone. Because it's an like... RV. He does it in an RV. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> but do you remember, like, the off-road tattoo that they done? I, that was, like, oh, the first yeah. movie. They, yeah, yeah. Dude. That's, like, the very first that movie. In, that was in the desert, bro. There was already sand yeah. on it. Well, uh, uh, Henry Rollins. All. He was the, he was driving the Jeep. Henry what was it? Was? Henry Rollins. Yeah, I think he was driving yeah. the Jeep. But, like, I had, like, a really Christian family member. She was, like, basically my grandma figure down there in Georgia, oh, okay. she gave me my first five dollar bill, and I went and bought the first Jackass movie on VHS. As you should. <laughs> yeah. She'd be so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> I've never told her that. But, <laughs> I, it's, I, I, just, I just love that, like people like that, and also South Park. I'm yeah, so glad remember. that people like that are still around. Oh, I love South Park because man. we need people to, you know, still kind of push the boundaries. Have you ever yeah. watched, you know, Bill Burr? Well, of course, you know who Bill Burr is. Oh, yeah. yeah, I love Bill Burr. Have you watched F is for Family? Dude? Yeah, yeah. So I like it, man, but it's just like, I don't know. Have I you kinda... guys uh, seen, what's it called? Uh, the Great North? Dang, that no. sounds familiar. The I'm Great not... North. It's what a Netflix. That? 
or it's Netflix or Hulu. I think it's Netflix though, The Great North. Is it a show? Mm-hmm. Dang, it's like it's familiar. like Bob's Burgers. It was made from Bob's Burgers. Oh, is that the one with Daniel Tosh on it? Maybe. I don't know. There's so many. You guys ever watch that? What what is that one called? It's a. Uh, it's this basketball one. He's the coach. Oh, oh hoops. hoops or something like that. Yeah, it's something like that. Seen, That's I've hilarious. Seen, seen That's that funny. Too, you want to show a don't like, dude? It's not funny to me. Big mouth, dude. I hate that. I, I hate, hate it. That. It's is so, that the one with the uh, Nick? The whatever. Like the kids are on it. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's like puberty kind of. It's extremely perverted, dude. Yeah. Uh, it's just so weird. I hate whatever. it. It's yeah, just, that. It's yeah, stupid, bro. I hate it. I couldn't really get into that. I couldn't sit through a whole episode. It's you know to each his own, but I, 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 I couldn't get into PD. it. I appreciate it. <laughs> I, I'm just happy that like that I, that there's a hip hop scene kind of growing around here. It's yeah. been I guess it's pretty it's much been grown for a little bit. But yeah, it's, 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 it's bigger now than it ever has been. Because man, whenever I first started around here doing that stuff, people were not for it. No, like it. And people still hate on it. Yeah, but but but, na- but nowadays it's accepted a lot more yeah. than because like dude, I was doing it back in 2009. And people were especially not back then. Yeah, even and like I remember, two thousand and nine is when I graduated back. kindergarten. <laughs> Dang. Say that again. I graduated kindergarten in twenty oh nine. Two thousand nine is twelve years ago. I'm eighteen. Wow, y'all, I've, y'all just made me feel old. Two thousand nine is twelve years ago. I'm not even ago. old, bro. That's the thing. Dude, can yeah, you believe twenty twenty in five months? Twenty twenty is going to be two years ago. Wait. So, In five months, 2020 will be two oh. years ago. It's just passing by so fast. That's simulation. Simulation theory, man. Time isn't real. Time's it's time two, two, isn't two, real. Two, time is just a concept, bro. Who came up with clocks? You know? Yeah. Who said that, like, hey, it's two o'clock? It's well, just guess. Nobody it. knows. Exactly. A- apparently, it went by a sundial, but, like. Yeah, but even but then. That's just, like, a shadow on a rock. How are you going to figure something out like that? What if you're like in a valley? You know, like yeah. how, how do you know that you placed the sundial correctly? Yeah, really. Now, time how, is real. And how do you figure out time zones? Tell me it. For real, how does that make sense? Time isn't real. There's probably a very easy answer and solution to that, but we have no we're, idea. We're just stupid. <laughs> But boys, unfortunately, we're gonna to have to wrap this up. This has been a lot of fun, though. It was definitely really fun. Absolutely. Look, bro, do you think I can play a song, bro? Yeah, man, yeah. let's play a song. You sure? All right, yeah. Where's my guitar's in there? In there yeah, go ahead and go get it. You sure? I get it. Yeah, man. That's cool. Well, are, are you going to like what kind of song are you going to be playing? Though, is it like one of yours, nah, or is it Trials of song, Terror, uh, Free Bird? I mean, like, what are we playing <laughs> here? Free I'm Bird play, on acoustic. Uh, uh, you ever heard of the band Modern Baseball? Yeah. You go. yeah. Play modern baseball song for you. Give me to move. Okay. Sure. <laughs> we are going to be back in just a little bit with a song from Skeezy. <laughs> you ready? <clears throat> okay. Ladies and gentlemen, Skeezy. I hate worrying about the future Cause all my current problems are based around the past And I hate when you call me late at night When you text me to make sure I got nothing to be sad about But it's alright and I'm okay I don't need your help anyway I will I hate having to think about my future When all I wanna do is worry about everyone but me I'm so tired maybe just bored I can't really tell the difference whenever I'm talking to you and I know that Adore starting off with me that way that there's no way that I'll assume that you're wasting all of my time living about your problems like how your Instagram stopped working and how your friends bailed on you but it was funny cause it was the day you were supposed to hang with me yeah about that I'm guilty as charged for leaving you on all I bet I know it's easy to see but it's crucial to blot out any signs that I might have feelings this way you won't 
ask me how am I this way you don't force me to proceed with actually having to tell you my worries with actually having you even a damn about me you even a damn about I hate worrying about the future cause all my current problems are based around the past and I hate when you call me late at night just to check in to make sure I got nothing to be sad about the alright and I'm okay I don't need your help anyway I will I hate having to think about my future when all I want to do is worry about everyone but me Bam. I like that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, get back over there, Woo! dude. Get back over there. Been there. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Skeezy, Space Boy, tell everybody where they can check out all the new music coming out. All platforms. All platforms. Just type in Zach Venn over. Hell yeah, and check out Ghost Pilot, my other band. We were here. Rock and roll. Yes, Love you, sir. Mom. Awesome. Space Boy, Skeezy, thank y'all. Peace. Peace. Boom. That was fun, man. That was fun. That was a lot of fun.